Hey everybody, welcome back to my Star Wars channel. My name is David and today we're going to look at the Star Wars Trader store in downtown Disney. We would be honored if you would join us. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Uh, my family and I, we just got back from California. Just got back from California, was excited to go to Disneyland and uh, California Adventure and check out some of the new stuff. We hadn't been back to the California parks in years, years and years and years. Uh, hadn't seen Galaxy's Edge over there. That's how long it's been. So I uh, was excited to see that, was excited to see, uh, you know, their version of Runaway Railway. And then of course, check out all the cool Star Wars stuff uh, they had down there. We've already made our plans for Florida. <laughs> so we got back from California and we said, we're going to Florida because uh, we because we just love it. So uh, we'll be going to Florida in May of next year. So uh, looking forward to that as well. But uh, I noticed that Star Trader was a new store in downtown Disney replacing the old Rainforest Cafe. A Rainforest Cafe is still around? I don't think there's like one left in the whole world, right? Where are, I think the one in Florida is still there. I don't know. What do you guys know about Rainforest Cafe? Tell me. Tell me, tell me down below. But uh, got there when it opened, the Star Wars Trader Store, and uh, walked around, wanted to show you what it looked like, and uh, show you some of the merch that's there, and yeah, just kind of do a basic overview of the store in case you hadn't seen it either. So the new Disney Star Wars Trading Post is uh, right here. So it's on the edge, right, of downtown Disney in California, and right there is the old ESPN bar and then over there that way that's the monorail station right so this is star wars trading post which used to be right rainforest cafe yep so it still looks exactly like the rainforest cafe except it has now a bunch of like cargo nets and that disc up there at the top you can see everything's draped so that it looks more looks more star warsy right but it's still the same exterior and really when we go inside you're going to see all the remnants of uh, the Rainforest Cafe as well. It's cool that they got Rey's Landspeeder out there in the front, even though it's turned the wrong way. She wears her net on the other side. This is right when the store opened. So you can see they've got some little modules outside that have uh, some clothing merchandise on it, which is really neat because when you go to Florida, all this stuff is kind of scattered around Galaxy's Edge, and then having this store with it all in one spot is really, uh, really cool. And I think for us that go to Florida more, kind of jealous that you guys have all of this in one spot. And uh, also jealous that there's uh, lightsabers here. So got all the droid parts, right? All the little droids. So you, you know, this is a whole extra store in Florida, but you can buy all of the the droid parts, the R2-D2 and the astromech stuff. There's stuff for, uh, you know, the, the add-on parts. And there was really everything here. There's so like, you can see there's costumes there. There was these gorgeous uh, Stormtrooper helmets um, from the Black Series, which, you know, are, were really awesome. There's the old uh, build your own lightsaber uh, station where the, you, know, you can make the little plastic lightsabers. And then look at this. These are the lightsabers that uh, in Florida, we literally wait in a line for <laughs> to look at. And you can just walk right up and look at them. So they've got the kyber crystals here and the readers. There's a whole bunch of clothing here. They've got toys here. Uh, this is a whole little uh, Darth Vader corner, a little dark side corner. They've got a second register. So there's plenty of uh, opportunity for someone to wait, wait on you and help you, which was really awesome too. So a nice variety of clothes. And really, going in this store, the Star Wars merchandise did differ from the stuff that's in uh, their Galaxy's Edge and their main Star Wars store. So here's all the toy Boba Fett stuff. So if you were planning on having your kid be Boba Fett for Halloween, uh, you got the, pretty much the whole costume right there. Took uh, some video shots of some of the decoration that was going around. And you can see the trees, right, and the... Um, molded shelving like this is all stuff left over from the previous uh, restaurant in fact when you look up at the ceiling 
you can kind of see where the restaurant was and they've really just put in a false ceiling because it was a second floor up there and that's where the, the restaurant actually was. And then downstairs, this was, you know, merchandise. And so it's still merchandise, but it's just now it's Star Wars merchandise and not Rainforest Cafe merchandise. So you can see they got this netting uh, hiding the upstairs and then there's still some trees, uh, molded trees in the middle there. I took a lot of footage of Boba Fett stuff, of course. And then there was these uh, Christmas ornaments and I did get a Christmas ornament this year. So pretty stoked about that. All right, that's everything. That is everything. And uh, I got a couple more videos coming up for you. Uh, one, I walked around uh, World of Disney and I, I grabbed all the different Star Wars stuff that's over there too. So I'll show you what's over in World of Disney uh, in a week or so. And then I got my very first Jedi Star Wars Disney <laughs> lightsaber so i had not purchased a lightsaber from disney yet had not got one of the new galaxy's edge sabers the new nice ones the new metal ones got my first one so excited to show it to you and uh yeah may the force be with you guys i'll see you next time bye